why not? I mean, it's one of the top level universities in the world and it's one of the members of the Russell Group University. So it does research, leading research in its science and technology group, which I'm interested in particularly because I'm doing an engineering degree. It's probably the best choice, I would say, to study and to do research. So yes, Southampton is the best. I wasn't sure what I was going to study next year. Like to start with, maybe civil engineering, maybe mechanical engineering, maybe programming. And foundation year is really a good choice if you're not sure. You're here on the campus, you can go to different faculties, you can talk to them, they give you really good advice. And another reason is, um, you know, I'm an international student, so when I came here it was a little bit different, obviously. And the foundation here really helped me to cope along, to go along with the British environment and everything. So yeah, it's really great. It's really friendly, first of all. It's because Southampton, I believe, as of now, uh, is built around the university itself. Everywhere you'll find students, everywhere you'll find someone like you, exactly like you, who's there to help you. Even if they're senior, they've been where you are right now. And so, when you're stuck at something, there'll always be someone who'll help you. Or there are libraries everywhere, there are books everywhere, there are students everywhere. So it's a really nice and friendly environment to study. Awesome. It was, I think, the best week ever. I had two freshers week, really, because one was set up for international students and one was for uh, home students, or older students in total, and of course the freshers ball. It was amazing because everyone was moving into the halls. There were people exactly like me. They came for me for help, I came to them for help. It was like a fair, really, like thousands of students all around the world coming here to study just like you, your age, you know, it's, it's amazing, it's amazing, it's festive. It's a very well organized course, uh, it's foundation, so we touch a little bit of everything. So you really get a taste of the engineering and science faculties around the campus. So we're doing a bits of science, bits of technology a little bit, some labs, so yeah, it's a bit of everything really. They're very interactive, you know, they're very engaging. It's not like you go to the lectures and you just um, read, they just tell you stuff. No, it's not like that at all. They help you, they come to you, they ask you questions, they want you to answer, they want you to be, you know, interactive. They want you to ask them questions. They don't. Uh, just tell you like, study this, study that, do that. You do work with them, they work with you. In exams and everything is set up to support you. Even if you're, it's personal stuff that you want to talk about, they'll help you with that either. We run study groups in our course, uh, run by students. Uh, I personally run one. Foundation here is a really versatile environment, yeah? People come from different parts of the world, from different sectors. Maybe there was some guy who was doing accounting, but he wants to do science now, he wants to do engineering. Like someone is good at this, someone is good at that. And we come together and we help each other overcome our problems. We meet like twice a week maybe, for four or five hours, six hours even. And it's the most amazing thing is it's not tiring, it's not boring at all, it's fun. It's because everyone, is, uh, everyone there is good at something, some stuff. So yeah, that's fun. That's a really fun way to bring along your students, your fellow students. Be prepared for uni, obviously. It's because uh, whenever someone says I'm going to uni, it's not like party all the time, you know? It's a lot of stuff because you will, you're here to learn and Southampton is, well, it's fun, it's amazing, but it's, because it's one of the top level universities, they expect only the best. And you should really expect to be, you know, worked hard. And you should be prepared for that. And, you know, Wednesday night may be party, but next morning you should be prepared to go to a nine o'clock lecture and study whole day long. So yes, be prepared to study a lot. <laughs>